Wearing red lipstick can be such a bold, beautiful, and daring choice, but a lot of times we're in a rush. I'm going to show you how to do your red lipstick beautifully and flawlessly, even when you're in a huge hurry. Here's how. I think the biggest mistake people make when wearing lipstick, red lipstick, and really any color, is that they don't have a mirror, or they have a mirror and they're just doing it really fast, and they just take their lipstick and they go like this. Ta-da! So that's my lipstick in a hurry. Now I'm going to show you how to make it more flawless and make it more perfect. If you have no lip liner, what you'll want to do is really make sure that you're paying attention to your lip line. See, when I did it in a hurry, I just kind of didn't get the lip line accurate. See, right here, that's already better. My lips have a little dip in between there. This was the job I did in a hurry. As you can see, red lipstick can make your lips look really thin because it's a dark, bold color. Make sure that you follow your lip line if you don't have a lip liner. If you have a lip liner, put it on after you've put on your red lipstick. I'll show you how. Here's my red lipstick on my hand. So you'll want to get a lip liner that's just a hair darker, border on really the same color. You don't want to go much darker, just a little darker, just to create a little bit of dimension and to make a flawless finish. I'm gonna try a couple of lip liners. This one, as you can see, is just slightly darker. That's the one I think I'm gonna use. That one's too dark. With lip liner, if it's the same color, you're not gonna get any dimension. It's just gonna look really flat. Some people like to overdraw. I do too, but not too much because then you can look like a clown. You wanna wear something a little bit darker. Follow the line see, of your lips. this is the side with the lip liner. This is the side without. Once you have your lip liner on, then you just wanna fill in further into your lipstick so that it's all nicely blended. If you have a couple of more seconds, you can add a little bit of shimmer and a little bit of gloss. I'll show you how. If you have some sort of shimmer cream, you'll want to use that. Just right there at the bottom of your lip. You're not going to put that over the whole lip. See that? It already makes your lips look fuller. I'm using a gold shimmer. You can use a silver shimmer or a gold. It creates the illusion of fuller lips. Then you can put a lip gloss on top of that. You can use a clear lip gloss or a shimmery one. I'm just going to put that on my bottom lip. And a tiny bit on my top lip. If you want to make sure you don't get any lipstick on your teeth, I know a lot of people put their finger in their mouth and then pull it out. I find it better to put it this way and then you prevent it from getting on your teeth. So there you go. Perfect red lips in a matter of seconds. <laughs> Bye. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you the next time. I have the lipstick. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the mom face mommy there she goes a little heart thanks for watching we'll see you next time say bye bye look right here and say bye bye <laughs> I'll fix it for you. I'll clean it off. Dad. Okay, mommy clean it off for you.